Do you struggle with weight loss and just can't seem to figure out how to lose the pounds? Well, you are not alone. Today marks a special day for everyone who has been struggling with losing weight because we are going to explore one of the most challenging obstacles to permanent weight loss in women, the mind-body connection. The mind-body connection may sound like magic and voodoo, but it actually makes a lot of sense and even medical science now emphasizes the need to harmonize the body and mind to improve one's wellness. There has always been an overemphasis on the physical when it comes to losing weight. Of course, in the end, the numbers do matter and when you are trying to fit into a pair of jeans that are two sizes smaller, all you can think about is, what happened to my waistline? But, what you may not know is that research suggests that our minds can sometimes be our biggest enemy when we are trying to lose weight. Our brains can actually hinder our bodies from experiencing the weight loss we desire. How? In today's post I will discuss the various mind-body issues that we all have experienced at one point or another that may play a role in hindering your weight loss. And I will share some simple solutions that will help you end specific mind-body misconceptions. Problem number one, toxic stress. Stress can be extremely toxic if you don't know how to manage it. Many people don't realize that stress impacts not just the mind, but also the body. If you want a more scientific term for it, call it physiological stress. When you are stressed, your brain sends an emergency distress signal to the rest of your body. Your fight or flight instincts kick in and suddenly, your body is only concerned with just surviving. The result? You'll feel exhausted and fatigued almost all the time. This can make your weight loss journey problematic, because you won't have the extra energy you need to achieve your weight loss goals. You can't lose weight if your stress levels are off the charts. Your mind won't allow you to use additional energy and resources on your new goals because it is in a physiological emergency state. You need to address the stress before attempting to start on your weight loss goals. How can you stop stress before it stops you? Here are some steps to help you with stress management. Step 1. Ask yourself, what is causing your stress? Be really honest with yourself. Step 2. If the stressor is a problem you have at work or at home, can you find a solution for it? Sit down and try to solve the problem so it doesn't bother you anymore. Step 3. If the stressor is something that you cannot solve, or it is simply an independent reality that causes stress sometimes, e.g. taking care of children, then learn to separate yourself momentarily from the stressor. If you feel like exploding from stress all the time, take a 5-minute walk outside or find a quiet room and do something you like. Learning to temporarily separate yourself from an unavoidable stressor can do wonders. Problem number 2, no tension release. Tension, like stress, can easily build up if you don't have an outlet to release it. When there is just too much tension, it can be nearly impossible to make the lifestyle changes needed for successful weight loss. If you don't have a way to let off steam, your mind-body connection will work against anything that requires your time and energy. This is probably one of the main reasons why people feel fatigued at work. The tension in their minds and bodies are just too much to handle. You can solve this problem through regular tension release. Having a tension outlet can greatly improve your life and help you achieve new goals. I suggest picking activities that will allow you to release tension without harming your body. Absolutely avoid activities like guzzling alcohol or smoking tobacco. Among the best tension busters are Playing sports Meditation Yoga Writing, journaling Travel Cooking Arts Problem number 3, not believing in yourself. Do our beliefs about our abilities matter when you are trying to lose weight? Yes. You can't achieve something if you don't believe that you can do it in the first place. Remember the saying, what your mind conceives, the body can achieve. That old saying was actually pretty accurate. Here's the truth. Experts who study body language and the subconscious mind agree that if you believe that you can do something, you're already halfway there. If we flip the situation, not believing in yourself will logically produce the opposite results. You wouldn't want that if you're eager to lose weight. So if you really want to prepare yourself well and strengthen your mind-body connection for the purpose of losing weight, you have to completely trust yourself and believe that you can achieve weight loss. But remember, it's not enough to just say that you believe in something. You also have to reaffirm that belief on a daily basis and actively use it to motivate yourself to accomplish goals. That way, your mind will be properly conditioned by the right beliefs and a positive mindset. The mind is a very powerful ally in weight loss, use it to your full advantage. 
If you enjoyed this video and want to see more, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and do not forget to subscribe as we share more information at Healthy Balanced Club website.